going to call on Pastor Olayemi Omojo to lead us in prayer. Pastor Omojo. Good evening, everybody. Can we please rise on our feet to, for prayers? Thank you, precious Father. We want to thank you for this wonderful occasion. We want to thank you for your son that you have kept him up to this present moment. We want to thank you for his message upon his life. The scripture says, if not for the Lord that has been by our side, we will have been consumed by our enemies. We thank you because you never allowed the hands of the wicked to prevail over his life. We want to thank you. He's counting his days and his numbers and his year and his returning glory and praise to you. We ask, oh God, that your mercy will continue to be upon his family, upon his life. That, Lord, you release heavenly vitality into him. We shall go from strength to strength, from glory to glory, from honor to honor. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And for everyone that is present to celebrate with him, Father, we decree celebration will never cease from your homes in the name of Jesus. We decree that the grace of God will abide with you and will take you far beyond the reach of your enemies in the name of Jesus Christ. And Father, tonight we declare this occasion open in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. And at the end of the day, we return glory to you. And the blessing will stay with us, the devil will take the shame. In Jesus' mighty precious name, we'll pray. Amen. Amen. Thank you, uh, Pastor. Uh, on my program here, I have uh, the whole Grammarian Society of America to give a speech on behalf of one of their uh, old students, Ola, Ola Wande, Ogunju Lumbe. Are we ready, the grammarians? Okay, good. The grammarians are here. Abara Amo Oli Tiri Neti Nani, Ebute Ru. Abara Amo Oli Tiri Neti Nani, Ebute Ru. I was a Peter Silamanda, he said the line is going on. Now, uh, the grammarians are here. Let's hear from them. It's your turn. Thank you very much for coming. Thank you. And I'm sure his brother would like to say something. Thank you. Um, 
my brother. He's always from my childhood since 70 years ago. <laughs> That's the first thing I know, I know, I, I'm going to say. He's always making jokes that he took the breast out of my mom's <laughs> you know, uh, breastfeeding. He makes that joke every time. Uh, I just want to make sure that he knows that. I'm not offended. <laughs> it's your turn and you took it. But the most important is that it's always on, we are all, always on each other's shadow every time. Actually, I started after the youth school, I went to St. Philip's College. So, I, Daddy said, No, you are not going to say St. Philip's College, you have to go to St. Philip's Grammar School. Because we are, yeah, I have to move, move into St. Philip's Grammar School. But it's, it's already in, in the school. So we are always on the shadow of each other. We have a senior brother. Senior brother. So, uh, 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 so I, I have a lot of, in my mind to say about him, but let's keep it short. Yeah. I just wish you the best. And I, I love you that much. I don't want to I don't want to be, be so uh, emotional about it. You know, I just love you and I wish you all the best. And I on behalf of Grammaria. I just continue to wish you the best and be so, so, that's what brother Thank you. Uh, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, it's a pleasure to be here to celebrate uh, the 70th birthday of my senior. Uh, a gentleman, as a matter of fact, he was one of those uh, seniors that I uh, look up to. Very neat and classy. Uh, you emulate his white, white, the way he dresses, and uh, he's uh, very friendly. He never looked down on the juniors. Uh, in those days, in those years back, you find that the seniors, I mean, you're, you're afraid of them. You know, never afraid of them. So, are you so uh, I want to uh, thank his lovely wife. Uh, for taking very good care of me because it looks like he's ageless. So we want to thank you and the good Lord will continue to bless you. You can see the smile on his face. We thank God for his life. So we, we're going to honor him with a famous school son. Um, CMS Grammar School is the first the first secondary school period in Nigeria and the best school so far. So, uh, there's no argument about that. It's a fact. So, uh, we're going to honor you with our uh, school song. And uh, please, if you can join us, uh, you're welcome.
and I can tell you that majority of the grammarians, they attended Anglican Primary School and transitioned to CMS uh, Grammar School. Unfortunately, I attended an Anglican school, but did not transition to CMS because I had to go back to my hometown to study. Um, but while in elementary school, St. Peter's, we always give them our time. Holy Trinity, St. Jude, and Holy Trinity. Mr. Babi, she been also for that one thing. Only I want more time. Ah, oh God. I want more time. Then when you look at the kitchen, kitchen no me o. Ah, I want me a new school. Now, uh, let's make it snappy and go to the speeches regarding the celebrant. I have it in order here. However, I'm going to call on the first person, Mr. Olushaola. Eba me fun ola tewo. Good evening, everybody. I've known Kupu for a long, long time. I had uh, an illness, and even my family knows that the illness will not keep me away from this man. I don't care what it is. I will do everything in my power to be here. Kupu has been we are just like five and six. We talk to each other almost daily. Um, he knows everything about me, even including when I was leaving Nigeria for the US in 1974. He came to the airport with me to send me up. And we are just big brothers. And uh, I can't be more prouder than person he is. And I wish you a very, very good 70th. Now you are in the seventh floor now. May God keep you so that you can go to the eighth and the ninth floor. Now I don't know about hundred, but you know, that's over time for us. Anyway, I wish you well. Thank you very much. Thank you, Mr. Olusha Ola. Odaki Honi Ola Ela Tomodi. A coffee genge. Omo Babed Master. Ah, please at this time, can the children move forward? Eh, Omo Kofo Ola Ogunjulube. Ola Wande Oluroti Mi. Then Ola Mudupe Ola. Mudupe Ola, what's wrong? Oh, you are just getting emotional, Daddy. Celebrating birthday. Okay, come, 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 come. Come and stay with them while you give the speech. Good evening, everyone. Uh, thank you very much for raising this occasion of my daddy's 70th birthday. Uh, thank you very much. Um, I'm one day, I'm Ola Okunjubi Bay. I'm, I'm Kofo's first son, <laughs> first child. Um, what will I say? I don't know what to say, but I'm speechless right now. Um, all I can say is, um, my dad is someone who is selfless. Yeah. He's a selfless person. He's someone who can go out of his way to help people, to support people, um, service-oriented and loving. Um, what does that one say again? He's, he has been a great father. Even while we're growing up back in Nigeria, he's always constantly hammering on this, ah, bye-bye, bye-bye, back with you. Discipline, discipline. Okay, okay daddy, I'm more disciplined. 
We all human beings, we make mistakes, but you have to do this. Get a cup, get a cup, spark it. Me and my younger brother, we grew up together. He's not here, he should be on his way right now. Roti is the, <laughs> is the job of the house, and you know, so. So uh, we learned a lot from him. He gave us a sound legacy, education, moral, and uh, uh, spiritual as well. Um, he's a, he's a, he's a God-fearing person as well. Um, I thank God for his life. I mean, like I would say, this is like the first thing I will ever like celebrate him for in my life. Even though through my childhood I had a little roller coaster, but everything in life that happens to now is a lesson to be learned. It's not a face you pass through and you feel bad about it and you know it's a lesson we learn and um, i thank god for my family i thank god for uh our mommy wife beautiful wife you know she's she's also like a mother to me too um, and my my siblings i love them so much you know I, I i do cherish them and i'm proud of them as well um not too much to say that to just celebrate today and make it a remarkable day a memory day, a day for him and um and I believe the host of heavens are also rejoicing with Kofu today. May he assure us my team my prayer. Hello everyone. Welcome in. Uh, I just wanted to first express uh, gratitude towards all of you guys for being here. It's amazing to have this congregation. Uh, my dad, I don't know what to say, I'm not going to say much, but He's a very, like he said, he's a very, very selfless person. He's always instilled in the idea of discipline, discipline, which is, which is something we've always carried throughout our entire life and we're still carrying on to today. We're very grateful to have him in our lives. We're very appreciative to be his son, daughter, and I'm just glad to be here. Enjoy the night, have fun, and just live. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Thank you, Ola Wande and Tenny Ola. You can tell that Tenny Ola attended Florida Atlantic University. Those students of FAU, they don't talk that much. Believe me. Because I attended FAU, so I know very well. Okay? So don't judge me on that. Now, Let's hear from Engineer Baba Tunde Ogunju Yukwe. Engineer, ah, Olori Ebi Kwata Kwata. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, in America. No, one day was only three minutes. We said, you'd let go. Eh, ni tori ya mwa tano wa do ni tiri niti. Ah, eh, you don't live with you. You live with you. That is a lie. Thank you very much. Yes, sir. Yeah. Um, where do I start? I first met uh, Kofu Ola on February 18, 1954. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I, that was like one, two, uh, three years and eight months, it was like one day. So, the first thing I said, I said, oh my God, I got my breastfeeding. From my mom. <laughs> what's going on? You know, I don't sit on mommy's lap anymore to get somebody else is there. But good enough for my grandmother, he came over and took me away to the book. To our you know. The funny thing is that at that time I didn't think about that very much. But Coco constantly remind me that I took the proudly I say I you know I took the breastfeeding away from <laughs> every time <laughs> every time you're gonna say Stuff like that, you know, uh, you know. So, but, but beside that one, you know, we grew up together. We grew through kind of a roller coaster in life. We are always at the shadow of each other, you know, we, each other. And mommy told me, "You are your brother's keeper. No matter what it is, you are your brother's keeper." We have a good relationship and God really uh, put us together in his own way. What I would just want to say to him is that whatever you achieve in life now, you achieve it on your own, not not, not doing God gave it your time. You have your own ticket. It's like when you say uh, uh, piggybacking 
It's like you, you piggyback somebody, you know. That's where I would see what he's telling me. But I know, no, God gave you your chance and you use it and you let you are blessed with it and you have your own ticket, everything you know, to, to do whatever you want to do in your life. And I just want to pray to you that God in his mercy will continue to be with you. Amen. Amen. He is going to continue to help you in all ways. He's going to magnify you in a beautiful way. Your talent, your amazing talent is always going to be there. God already provision you to be who you are. Yes. Not uh, You are not picking back in on anybody. You are your own and you have made it. And, uh, and of course, the, the grace of the God, no matter what you do in life, what you achieve in life, without the grace, it's not nothing. And I thank God for his grace in your life and that he's going to, going to continue to be with you and with us. As a family, we are family of God, Lord, and people, and we can see that one throughout our life together. And uh, we are siblings that really love God, that individually we love each other, we love our friends, we love our identity, and that is what we hear from our parents. That is, so I just thank God for your salvation. Today is your day, enjoy it. And I just wish you all the best, and we're going to dance with you, and, you know, you, 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 you are your own, now, and you, you just enjoy a great week. So, thank, thank you for everybody that comes from my head, I just thank you, I just, I just, I, I was just amazing when you came over, things that I couldn't do in those days when I was there. He started doing it, he started mingling with people, he started becoming part of different organizations and everything. I was here years before then. I wasn't doing that. I was just going to school and I put my body up right there. <laughs> we always need to do we do it differently. But it, you know, that's why I'm saying you are your own, you are, you are doing the right thing. You know, and this is where I got brought uh, everything that your call. He has an amazing talent. So that's, that's what I can, I can just say about you. you know, thank you for everyone. Thank you, thank you, sir. Engineer Baba Tunde And on behalf of Kufuor Olawa I want to thank you again. Because I've never seen a day that we talk about the Ukunjulube family. That uh, Mr. Kufuor Olawa will talk about the headmaster and will say, ah, my brother. Engineer, Baba he has done a lot in my life. So, on behalf of Mr. Okunju Tupeko for and his family, I thank you very much for what you have done and what you will continue to do in his life. Do we have Dr. Adewumi here? She's not here yet. Okay, let me have the lady from the Methodist Church to give us a solo right now. Miss Claudette McNeil Stenner. Please give her a round of applause. She's from the Methodist Church. Thank you. Hey, Kelly, oh. Right now. All right, got you. Good evening, everyone. It is a pleasure to share in this auspicious moment with Mr. Kofo. I usually call him Mr. Coffee and he just laughs. And what's wrong with that girl? But it, he's such a pleasant and he has such an awe. When he walks into a room, you can't help but staring like, who is he? Isn't that wonderful to have that kind of an appearance? You know, he, he's just who he is who God wants him to be now, who you think he is. So I'm so, so a privilege to have this honor to sing to my evil. Let's hit it. And on behalf of Northern United Methodist Church and our pastor, Reverend Margaret Cartway, we want to say, may God continue to bless you. Real good. Go ahead. As a hero 
If you look into your heart, you don't have to be afraid of who you are. There's an answer. If you reach into your soul, and the sorrow that you know will melt away. is the district superintendent of United Methodist Church. Right from Palm Beach all the way to Key West. Get up for recognition, please. Thank you and welcome to Broward County. Uh, we are going to skip the program to go to dinner. Uh, however, before we pick up our food, I want to say something. Everybody has been saying something since but I don't see anybody talk about 1759 St. James Gate, Dublin. Does anybody know the significance of that here? St. James Gate, Dublin. Oh my God, those of you that are very close to Kofu, it means you don't know him very well. 
Kofo can never do without drinking Guinness Stout. That's 1759, St. James Gate, Dublin. And I wonder why he has not been served with Guinness. That's the Guinness man. Odeku. So he's going to drink Guinness tonight. Uh, please, we have the food to the right. You have swallow, Amala. When we wait to Toda, all your tower and Kenin, who I know you are laughing to watch a Kerimade or Mati. Any Jesha, in your imaginary Kaya City Amala, our bad old Bumoso, or your Nicola Godo, dear Malala, in your Nika India Kalukuro. Well, I be Shano and what you would do it, Oseba. So please, um, in order not to be crowded, let's go table by table. Okay, the table with the least number of people, BJ. Let's start from your table. Are you ready? Ah, please excuse me, Mr. DJ. Uh, the bar is right in front of me. We have Guinness, we have Heineken, we have Hennessy, we have vodka. Please drink responsibly. If you are caught by the cops drinking, just tell them, Arekulia Jai said, you can go for tonight. Okay, so which go? I don't know, but you can go for tonight. So we have water, we have everything over there. Ah, while they are getting food, let's hear from one of the sons that is just here. I've been told that you are on your way. Onuwaro Timi, Ogunju Lupe. It's your turn. And I apologize for being late. Uh, Okay. <laughs> I, I just want to, you know, say something wonderful for my dad. You know, it's been amazing in my life. You know, being here today is not by my own you know, grace, you know, by God, you know, but also it was a huge part in, you know, who I am today. You know, when I go back into the discipline and everything, it has always instilled in me, you know. <laughs> yeah, I've yeah, been very, very stubborn, you know, so, hey, I can go, yeah, that's my baby, my money, this all, you know, even the good shit, you know, this all the black shit. Are you serious? Who is saying? Oh, ah, hey, I'm going to go to Well, anyway, I'm just saying, like, you know, I thank God, I thank God for my dad, you know. Is, is amazing. It's amazing. It's amazing. You know, let me let me get back to the point. To the point of like, you know, the discipline and you know, it is still to me because that's one thing I always know my dad for. As a matter of fact, going to say, you know, he does a, he's a he's a very very time punctual kind of person. He's not like you know. So you know, uh, you know, I'm actually gonna uh, apologize for that. You know, number one. So and I thank you, Dad. You know, for everything you've done for me. You know, I love you so much. You know, you really, really deserve it. Everything you are today, and you know, who you are today, and who you've become today, you know, you know, you really deserve every step in your life. And the family, your amazing wife, I love her so much, you know, she's beautiful, you know, and I, you know, I love all our family because, you know, this is a special moment in like, you know, in the history right now because we, you know, we're all together, all family is one, you know, you know, we're, you know, we're very, very loving, Big family, so and I'm so excited. And I guess that's why I'm really, really excited because I'm, you know, I miss my people. So I love you, Dad, again, and thank you, everybody. Am I being again? Thank you, Oluro Timi. Yeah, your brother told us about you before you arrived. Olawa and the Abimbola, Uruko and Yuruko Baba, I know you are me. One day I've been bola. You know one day I've been bola, the vice chancellor of Ife. Yeah. 
So your yours is Olawande, his is Ogunwande, Abimbola, Omo, your Malavi, I disappear your life. Or you should be by Benny, go confess to me, the pay centers. Uh, while we are getting our food, I want to recognize uh, the youngest baby of Pastor Simeon Moraki Ogunjulube and late Mrs. Felicia Ogunlomo Ogunjulube, Mrs. Kemi Adelusi Mi Ogunjulube. Please wave and let them see you. That's the black Ebony. Hallelujah. What can I say unto the Lord? All I have to say is thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. All I have to say is thank you, Lord. I thank God for today. It's been a wonderful day since me from church, home, and here. I thank God on behalf of Brother Kofu, the Sarkofu, the historian of the family. He has the history of the family. He will tell you the hour, the second, the minute you were born. He will tell you the list of the grandchildren, the great grandchildren. Oh, this is number two. This is number six. He's an historian. He will tell you even your life history. Ah, uh, Kenya, uh, you know that. Ladies, I tell you, no, no, you see, no. I'm a grandma myself, so don't, don't start telling me story again. That historian of the family is a wonderful man, and he's always kissing me. Ah, last one, the last one of the family. If I know, there are three anyway. That is one. This is one and myself. So when he wants to abuse all of us together, put us together. Hey, if I knew that he met that's why the man yo yo Fanu. I thank God for his life. I came from Nigeria because of him. Because I told him I'll be here and God made it possible for me to be here. I thank God my family, they are all here. We are one family and we always come together when we are doing things like this. I thank you all for being here. Appreciate your presence. They are all wonderful people. Enjoy the day with us and may God bless you. Thank you, thank you. Uh, Mrs. Akiba Ije, Ejo, Eba Wasabu Celebrant, Kuchuru Kuchuru Loma Lagbe De Kifi Loko, Eba Wakbe Yon Jisha Wasoke, Eduwe Pino Do Foya Jebu. Are you ready?
And you can even see the wife with the gele. That's made in Nigeria, you can tell by the color anyway. All right? All right. Again, pictures like this break memory. I'm very sure you see that's the uh, son who is a proud United States Navy official. Let's give him a round of applause, please. Serving the great United States of America. And that's proud dad, you know. The man, I think you need the accord over there, too. Yes, again, memory. It's, it's just exciting when you see yourself and you, it reminds you of what's going on at that time that you took the picture. That's the troublesome boy right on the other side. With you. <laughs> it's a good kid, though. Happy family. Wow, well, that must be the Navy's wife. They always get beautiful women, not like me ugly girls. <laughs> Happy family again. So excited. See him again? I think you need a haircut. You know, my haircut. <laughs> yeah, this is Fantastic Four. Yes, I see that. Brothers and sisters. Amazing family. When you celebrate birthday, these are songs that you celebrate. Good memory from a good family. That's the FAU. I thought it was FIU. But it's FAU graduate. Congratulations. You did go to FIU like me. Wow. It's a Navy man. Yes. If you are not a captain, I'm going to make you a captain today. <laughs> Great USA. You can see the difference between Nigeria uniform and American uniform. Yes. Okay, okay, okay. I'll just... Okay, I'm going to leave. As you leave, it's okay. Okay, I'm just... I'm just comparing. Okay, it's okay, it's all right, just, just comparison. <laughs> Amazing. Wow. Yes, I met a Nigerian Air Force guy, a Navy guy the other day. I thought they are from Ajegunda with their uniform. <laughs> Please, let me watch my back. A lot of Nigerians in the house here. Yeah. Again, happy family. Wow. Mr. Kofo, God bless you, man. I see why you are celebrating. Great memory. Wow, that's the grandson. Oh, good. This way you did your 14 years birthday, right? Or 14. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give Mr. Kofu a round of applause. DJ, give me that song. Um, every day we wake up. One second. We wake up and uh, we celebrate like today. It's not the number of years that we've given the Lord here on earth, but the blessings. The family joy, the great things that God has blessed us with. When you look up and you look down, you will still remember that God is the merciful, He is the only one that can take care of you. Oh, yes. I will shout. I will sing. There's no God like you.
make you move tall. Murphy. Uh, at this time, I'm going to call on the celebrant before we go to Oriki Ileo Kujurupe to come down for the cake cutting. Baba Sevuti, it's your turn to come down. And I'm glad when I said you married up, you said yes. Yes. Allow me. Don't forget to do it. 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 Don't forget to do I need a to Ah! I'm I want to move to the and do day. I want to celebrate the farmer. Okay, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I don't know if you're at work.
Ifanu Kujulukye. This is the first time this will happen because the Oriki is written in Ujisha language. So she's going to be my PA for tonight.